Well, a very exciting contest here. Algeria Sid Azara against the reigning European champion Datanashvili. Twenty-six-year-old Datunashvili taking the European crown during the summer of this year, defeating Radik Kuliev of Belarus in the final, and now looking to add a world crown. Finished 18th at the Olympic, <coughs> so excuse me, 18th at the Olympic Games. But a two time European champion, impressively retaining the original gold he won in 2016. It's a real disappointment, his performance at the Olympic Games, but he's gone up weight divisions. His first European crown was at 75 kilograms. His last at the 80 kilogram stage in which he fights today. But he faces the African champion at 80 kilograms, Sid Azara. And he has a slender one point advantage after almost two minutes of this opening round. Well, impressively, Azara was a multiple junior African champion, and then actually won the juniors and the seniors in the same year, 2016. Impressive performance, and he was a bronze medalist at 84 kilograms at the last Junior World Championships. So, two fighters with a huge future and pedigree mixed into one. Incredible to see two successful young wrestlers already contesting such a challenging match in qualifying at these World Championships. And it's Datu Nashvili, two-time European champion, who takes a slender advantage after round one. It's still very much a contest with twists and turns you'd expect. But for the moment, it's the European champion who has the edge. So this titanic battle between the European champion from Georgia, Datunashvili, and the African champion, Sid Azara, is proving to be a classic so early in the morning. But plenty here able to enjoy it as the crowd fills out as the morning progresses. Those who have traveled to Paris, or locals who have turned out, certainly an appetite for wrestling 
here in France. And it's Sid Azara, who now has slender lead to protect. You can see the blue hand, Datunashvili, being warned to be more active. Remember, passive activity, punishable by a point. And it looks like the Georgian has been penalised again. The red card did go up on the far side, but the scoreboard suggests nothing doing as yet. Potentially just a warning, but once again you see the this time the red hand of the referee. Just a warning there. Coming into the real crunch time. And it's the smallest of margins. And Daris Sashvili back on level terms and in the lead after Sid Azaria penalized for inactivity. Well, the rules there to encourage the sport to try and entertain and be entertaining. The wrestlers have to try and do the calculation of whether it's worth the risk to try and find the right moment to make their move, but it's Sidazara who needs to do something in these final 45 seconds. This brilliant clash between the African champion and European champion. But which will progress to the main draw of the World Championships here at 80 kilograms. Well, the Georgian finished second in the Olympic qualifying tournament, only to finish disappointing 18th place. But a two-time European champion, one at 75 kilograms, and the most recent at this weight division at 80 kilograms, looks like he's going through. And that is that, the slimmest of wins. Relief there more than anything for Datunashvili. And a real disappointing end for Sid Azara. The African champions going home.